This Eve is tomorrow night with Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Roger Susanan and the Something's Cooking crew celebrated the Feast of the Seven Fishes a little bit early. He likes to celebrate that guy. <laughs> Roger he visited. Really <laughs> yes, he does. He visited an iconic New Haven seafood restaurant. Check it out. And then this is like one of our most popular items, which is the half fish, half shrimp platter. No matter what you call it. You can call us D'Amato's, D'Amato's. It doesn't matter how you say it. D'Amato's Seafood is a special place. Just as long as you know where to find us at 423 Whaley Avenue, New Haven. Luckily for Vivian and the entire D'Amato's team, loyal customers have kept the seafood restaurant going strong in the New Haven area since 1933. This is actually my grandfather here. At, you know, I learned a lot from him. Toma, along with his brother Rico, are fourth generation owners. They keep everything in the family by running the business with Toma's wife, Jennifer. As I met my husband when I was 16 and I wanted to be with him so badly all the time that I was willing to scrape porgies in a kitchen and get scales all over me just to be next to him. And here I am about 27 years later. And with ingredients this fresh, who'd want to go anywhere else? You can see all of the seafood is chilled over ice, just like Toma's great-grandfather did it, so everything can be made to order. We tried to keep it old school how they did it, you know, almost 90 years ago. This is how it was done, and we just kept that tradition going. One tradition is the phrase, hook it up, which began because Toma's dad, Anthony, used to yell those words whenever he took an order. Hook it up for him, hook it up. So that term kind of became our logo, and it's on our shirts, it's on our menus, and we still say it today. And D'Amato's is hooking up lots of families for the Feast of the Seven Fishes on Christmas Eve. Their five-pound platter with flounder, shrimp, calamari, scallops, and clam strips is a great start. We have the same customers that come back once a year. They get the same stuff. Uh, you know, faithfully. For now their grandchildren come for Christmas Eve and, you know, just during the year here, which is very cool. You can also keep it casual with an awesome fish sandwich. The classics on the left, the D'Amato Roll and D'Amato Jr. have the same great flounder with extra fixings. The history is tasty. I'm really proud and I know there's not a lot of places like this anymore that, you know, could say they have over almost 100 years of history. All right, my hungry homies, just look at this beautiful feast that the D'Amato family made for us. Now, I could go with the best value on the menu, which is the D'Amato Jr., but anybody that knows me knows that I'm an old-school kind of guy, so I have to try this classic fish sandwich. Oh, you know what you have to do this holiday season? You gotta hook it up, baby. Reporting in New Haven for Something's Cooking, I'm Roger Suzanne, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. So good.